Hey guys, just before this video starts, if any of you guys are looking to buy or sell any cheap Rocket League credits, blueprints, items, basically anything you want, AOEAH is a third party website that buys and sells Rocket League items. If you want to check it out, use the link in the description and use code XYZ on your checkout for 6% off your order. Yo, what's going on guys? Uh, sorry if I seem a little annoyed. This is the third time recording this because every time I try to open up crates, for some reason my FPS drops from perfect to 2 FPS. It's like a... I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a, a like a presentation you do in school. It's like every every like half second there's one frame. Um, so today we're just gonna be chilling, opening up some crates until I get a black market. And then I'm giving away the black market to one of you lucky viewers. Uh, I'll explain how to win the giveaway later in the video when I get the black market. So stick around till then. Uh, but yeah, let's just vibe, open up some crates. Up until recently, um, I was having a pretty good day um, until a bunch of technical issues happened, and now it's magically working just fine. All right, I don't I don't know why there was issues earlier. I didn't really do anything to fix it. It just kind of fixed itself on its own. It was weird because my PC was at like twenty, like my CPU was at like twenty percent. My GPU was at like 30 something percent. So it's like it shouldn't have been overloading the system, but it just decided that, hey, Rocket League just isn't gonna work properly. I don't know why. Um, <laughs> and I don't, I don't know why it's different now. Like nothing has changed. Um, but yeah, I guess it's, it's better now. <laughs> uh, at least it's working better now. So uh, yeah, I, I've had an interesting day. You know, it's been pretty good. I had a calculus exam. Uh, I think, I think it's one of four this entire semester, um, and I, I feel like I did pretty good. I did good on everything except for one problem, which I was really annoyed about. Is um, the teacher had put something on the exam that wasn't in the review, and I know because I did the entire review earlier today, and then. I, after the test, I was like, I'm pretty sure that wasn't on the review. I went back to look at the review just to make sure I wasn't going crazy. And sure enough, yeah, it just, it wasn't even on the review. So that really annoyed me. <laughs> but I guess, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, I got everything else right, so it's not too big of an issue. It was just really annoying. <laughs> and now, hopefully, we're going to get... A black market decal here to you know make up for things today maybe Rocket League will take pity on me Ooh, breakout type S I was really hoping that they'd make it so you could get painted breakout type S uh, import bodies out of these crates but I don't think they're ever gonna do that I, I don't know why they haven't like you'd think they're in the game like this crate already gives breakout type S's why not give the ability of getting a painted one I don't know why they don't, but who knows. It's the same reason you can't get painted dueling dragons out of uh, any golden crates. Even when certain golden crates still give out dueling dragons, they just don't give out the painted variants, which is very, very weird to me. Like, I, I, I would think that you should be able to get one. Maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just my bad thought process, but I don't know. It just feels like it's weird that they don't have that in yet. It's like they're just trying to milk the item shop for all of uh, the Rocket League community's money that we have left. <laughs> it's like, jeez, as if the crates didn't milk our money enough. You guys gotta add an item shop now. <laughs> On top of the crates. Oh, jeez, especially these crates are... 200 credits a pop each. It's like, geez, they're a bit expensive, Cyanix, don't you think? <laughs> uh, if only they, uh, they had it like the good old days, where it was only one key to open a crate, which nowadays would be 100 credits. Nope, it's, it's more expensive now. And, okay, I don't know why Discord... Discord, no, well, my Discord isn't even open. Hang on. Okay. I don't know why. That was weird. Um, my Discord never has pop-ups like that. So something must have changed in my PC settings. 
Uh, so I have to look into that. Yeah. This is really weird today. My PC's just been acting up for no reason. It's kind of annoying. I'm planning on getting a new PC over the summer. Uh, I, I've looked into it. I can spend anywhere between like 1200 and 1500 and have a PC that's pretty much twice as good as what I currently have. And I mean, I've had this this big old boy for like three years now. It's kind of crazy to think like that after three years, it's a computer starting to get old. Like it runs the games just fine. Um, but you know, I want to have faster exporting, all that, uh, just for video purposes and editing purposes. It would just make, uh, all my exporting and like, you know, the work side of YouTube, it, it would make everything like twice or three times as fast at a minimum. Um, so that would be really freaking nice. I don't know why my phone just fell on me there. I have it propped up here, charging, and it just fell on me. Everything is not, it, it's just... It was my day earlier, you know, things were going good, and now it's just, I don't know. I'm getting hit with some bad luck today. Hopefully that's not gonna go into these crates, because I, I really need some good luck right now. Like, I opened up 102 of the new Golden Lanterns, if you guys didn't see that the other day. Um, if you guys haven't seen that yet, and you wanna go see what what's in the new Golden Lanterns, go check that video out. I'm gonna give you a few seconds to leave this video and go watch that one. Okay, spoiler alert, I got no black markets in those 102 crates. Now, that's a lot of crates to not get a black market. Like, usually you get a crate, uh, I mean, a uh, black market every 1 in 100 crates. Like, usually it's it's 1%. That's, that's what Psyonix has claimed is the statistical chance of getting a black market. It's 1%. So it's a bit odd to me that I opened up over 100 crates and still didn't get one. I mean... I guess it isn't that crazy. Like I've I've had in the past where I've opened up like three, four hundred crates before I got one black market, and that was just oh that that just sucked. Um, but yeah, I I mean I hope we don't go into a streak like that because honestly I I I'm not trying to sit here and open up three hundred crates. <laughs> Holy, I could not survive that. <sighs> Import, okay. Oh, gray. I still need a titanium white octane MG88 from these crates. I still need one. Because I am going to use that a lot once I uh, once I get it. Oh, it's going to be a nice decal to have. Going to pair that with a nice titanium white octane. Uh, best thing I think I'm going to do is uh, take the primary and secondary color and just make them the same color no matter what I make them as long as they're the same color it'll look like just a base normal car with just the white lines popping up everywhere I think it'll look pretty cool I'm probably gonna go for like a gold ish kind of vibe um, you know to match with the alpha set um, on the blue team I'd probably just go with a nice simple like ocean blue like, you know that one standard blue, pretty much, that everyone uses on their cars? It's that basic blue. Not the sky blue, not the sky blue. Like, the deep ocean blue. You guys probably have no clue what I'm talking about, or you just think I'm crazy. I'm more likely to be crazy than anything else. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> uh, Dominus GT. That's another one that I wish we could get the painted variants out of these crates because I would love to be rocking a titanium white Dominus GT even though one hit the item shop the other day I ended up not buying it I should have I didn't though I really should have though because it's like man I just wish that I I had gotten it because I'm regretting it now <laughs> oh we got a uh, Xeno Splash here or no a Tachyon a Tachyon a Tachyon right here there we go. If you guys didn't hear, whenever you get a boost in Rocket League out of a crate, in the first about half second of that crate opening, um, you'll hear a little audio cue that'll be the boost. Uh, so you can kind of tell what you're gonna get before you even get it. Like I've had a lot of comments asking me how I 
uh, in one of my videos recently, every single time a boost popped up, I would say exactly what it's going to be. I got a comment asking me, like, how how do I know what it's going to be every time? That's how. It's because there's that little audio cue at the beginning. Although I am good with my predictions. If you guys haven't seen my predictions in past videos, whew. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> Although I am good with predictions. I, I'm not that good where I could just call anything out of a crate. Like, this is going to be an exotic. It wasn't an exotic. This next one's gonna be an exotic though, right here. Wasn't an exotic. You know, I could be, you know, more simple and just be like, oh, this is gonna be a very rare. Just because I've gotten two rares in the past two crates. And, oh, okay, of course it's an import. <laughs> Sky Blue Mantis. I can't even win when I, when I guess something simple. Let's go with a rare here. There we go. 50% chance of being right there. I'll take that. Ah, uh, this will be a very rare. Another import. Okay. Oh, it's a furry. Yeah, that one doesn't really count. But there'll be another very rare here, though. There we go. I finally got it right. <laughs> I wonder if I opened up 100 crates and tried to guess the rarity out of each one. It would be a rare here. Hey. I... I wonder how many times I'd get it right. Like, should I should I do that as a video? Like, see how many times I get things right. Would be cool. Interesting to see the uh, how how good I am truly at predicting items. But it would be kind of boring because you know half of the items you you have a fifty percent chance of getting a rare. Half of the time I'd be like, ah, oh, rare, 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 and I I it just feels like. It would be kind of boring to just say rare all the time. <laughs> I don't know. I'm also um, starting to work on that uh, 500 credits to 500,000 credits trading series. If you guys didn't hear about that, I announced that I'm going to start a new trading series soon. I figured, you know, why the heck not uh, try it. <laughs> I mean, it's only 500,000 credits. It's not that much. Oh! <gasps> Hey, I've actually been wanting to get this for a while, so that's actually nice. We got the Titanium White Octane MG88. Finally! I was just talking about that earlier in the video. Nice. Ooh, and some Saffron Show Off Zombas. Love that. Love that, bro. That's awesome. Then we got a Xeno Splash right here. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you heard it. Let me know if you heard that little audio cue. Right at the beginning of the crate. It's how you always know. <sighs> hey, and there's a black market! Just as I had a disappointed sigh because we hadn't gotten one in a while. There it was! Alright, we got a hexed. Um, so as I said, guys, uh, if you want to enter this uh, giveaway for this beautiful hexed, anyone on any platform can win it. Just go to the link in the description for my Discord server. It'll just say my official Discord server, and then there'll be a link. Just click that link, uh, and then wait a few seconds as you get joined in by the auto-join bot. It, I, I have a bot that basically has preventative measures of a bunch of scammers joining the server. So, you know, it just verifies your account, makes sure you're not suspicious, and then it lets you in, and then you just go to the hashtag giveaways page, and then there you go. It'll be free to enter. See you guys next time. Take care. Peace out.